get your fur jacket, the first thing that you want to do is just steam it a little bit because um, they get squished in the package so they don't look the best when you just get them and also you just want to like poof up the fur a little bit so it gets like more volume and yeah Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Melody and today I have uh, an AliExpress uh, fur coat that I want to show you guys. Um, let me just go ahead and show it. So this is the coat. It has these beautiful, big, um, puffy sleeves. So, and it, the most interesting part is this, um, collar design. It's very, um, unique and it has a belt. It's on the shorter side, but overall I thought it's like a really cute black, um, wool coat. And the price was $160 and I think it's like a really good price for something of this quality. Um, I will try it on and I'm really happy about this purchase because it's um, really wearable. You can just, um, it's black so it's really easy to wear black usually but um, it also comes in white so the white will stand out a lot more but for me um, white is not as wearable because usually like um, I end up getting stains on it and for coats like you can't just put it in the washing machine you have to take it to like a dry cleaner so um, for that reason I went with the black one but um, the white one is also really cute if you want to just wear it for some occasions I suggest going with the white and they look so nice with um, wide white wide-legged trousers and this coat look so stylish and elegant um, I've seen it on Instagram and um, there are a lot of boutiques that sell these at a much much higher price um, but they do drop shipping from Aliexpress so I'm just going to prove to you guys that you get exactly the same thing whether you purchase it from Aliexpress or these high-end boutiques they are um, wool and fur so the material is exactly the same completely genuine and um, yeah, if you just want to save money, go with AliExpress. And there is also um, another seller on AliExpress selling the exact same thing um, for $250. So that one comes with DHL, but this one came with AliExpress standard shipping. The only thing is that that particular seller also has it in white, but this one only has it in black. And, but the price is like about a $90 different. Um, with DHL, you will get it like in a, less than a week. It's really quick. Like from the time you make an order, it's like going to be extremely quick. But this one took maybe about two weeks. Still like really nice. So I'm gonna try it on now. So yeah, this is the black one and the style is super unique and interesting. 
So the pockets initially come closed, but you have to like open it up. I forgot to do that now, but you just take a scissor and um, open the pockets. And this is size small um, because I just wanted it to be really fitted, um, but it also has medium and large. And I styled it with these um, suede tie high boots. soft and really voluminous for $160 like this quality is amazing um, like usually like nowadays just the coat from Zara is $200 and it's just like a simple wool coat and this is like I don't know it has like the natural fur as well so it adds like to the value and yeah, underneath I styled it with a white top and black skirt. Unfortunately, today is really hot in Toronto. It's like 20 degrees, so I feel so hot wearing this today. Um, but pretty soon I will get to wear it. And yeah, you can just see like how nice it is. And So yeah, that's um, for the coat, if you guys want to see more um, styling with this coat or you have any suggestions, let me know. Um, now that I have like a beige coat, a black coat, and a kind of another sandy coat, I might go for a white next time. Um, so I'll put like some pictures towards the end of this uh, video and I would really I would really appreciate it if you guys would help me choose another coat. Um, I also purchased some stuff from Abercrombie since um, but not a lot. Um, yeah since I returned most of the stuff from Zara I didn't feel like they were really my style although like they were beautiful pieces on their own they didn't completely suit my stuff but Abercrombie has a really good stuff um, for the fall season so if you, if you see my past Abercrombie haul I ordered a black sh um, sheer kind of top I liked it so much that I also ordered it in white color and this is how it looks like. It is again really beautiful. White button up shirts are a must have and um, they look great on everyone. They make you look a little bit more sophisticated without looking too bossy or too um, dressed up. They're just like the perfect balance of like being dressed up and not being overly dressed up so I love them and they just go with so many outfits and um, yeah a sheer one is like a more feminine style and to make it appropriate you can always wear a tank top under so it's very versatile and to match this or well you can wear it with anything but decided to get a suede skirt so previously I bought the skirt that I'm wearing now it has like a belt it's like a suede material but um, 
it's in black color they also had this one in the brown color but i thought it would be weird to have exactly the same skirt in two colors so i didn't get it last year but this year um i picked up the simple suede skirt so it doesn't have a belt but it's simple and it will go with so many um outfits and i think with this white top it would look really nice um so yeah this is um and the tone is so beautiful and these skirts um they have like a little bit of stretch into them so they're very very comfortable and i got this one in extra small even though like if it didn't have the stretch like i would get the small but since i had the one from last year um in extra small um i thought i'll pick it up in the same size and i also just because this skirt was like really cheap um i also picked it up it's like a knitted uh, skirt in white and this would look cute with um, beige tops or a pink top or a white top I already have um, the long skirt with a slit in white and a matching top and this was um this is like gonna go with the top and um this would be good because sometimes you have a short kind of coat and you don't want your long skirt to stick out so i would instead wear it with the short one and yeah that was my reasoning i also um got this tennis skirt in white it has like shorts under it as well but this one fits so weird that and yeah i was not happy even with the quality it feels like the stuff that i got from uh shein which were like so much cheaper so i don't know why abercrombie didn't make this like a more buttery like softer material and also like the fit is not good um so yeah i was really disappointed with this one and I'm gonna return it. I wanted to um, pair it with this top that I previously got from Abercrombie and this one has this buttery like nice quality to it um, but the skirt doesn't so I wanted to pair these together and wear it with like a white cap but yeah unfortunately I will probably have to wait for what they they're gonna come out with next year hopefully it will be better and improved so this is the um sweet skirt it fits really nice and i'm keeping this one 100 percent it was like 50 dollars which was reasonable and abercrombie's quality is always the best And here's the white top. It is see-through, so I would wear something different under, and you just have to be aware of what you wear. Um, right now, I'm not really, I don't really care about what's under because I'm just showing it to you guys, but I would probably wear like a white um, kind of bralette. Um, yeah, I really, really like this like combination. And the top is so flowy and compared to the other white top that I have which is not um, see-through this one like it doesn't get easily wrinkled which is a plus I could also wear it with um, some other tops that I have from Abercrombie 
which are like a little bit short and cut so And here is the white knitted skirt. I wouldn't wear it maybe with this one, but I think it's okay too. It looks cute. Um, but I have like the matching white top, which I'm just too lazy to get. But even with this top, I think it would be like very nice too. Yeah, the more I look at it, actually, um, the more I like this set, too. And just in case you were wondering, this is how the sheer top looks with the knitted um, skirt. And if you wear a proper bralette, unlike me under, maybe you could even like tie it in the front. And then here is the tennis set. Um, so I had the top from before and the skirt is new. So it has like shorts under it. And then Yeah, so I'm not really sure about the skirts, but yeah, let me know what you guys think. I think I might have to size up. It just is not really stretchy. Um, the material is, so this like top is super like buttery and stretchy, but like this one, um, it's like very restrictive, but I don't know, I'm not sure. And it also like bunches up a little bit as you walk. Yeah, so as you walk, it tends to like bunch up like this. So I think if it was made a little bit better, uh, it would be so much. It would just be the perfect. So yeah, thank you so much for watching the video. I hope it was helpful. And if so, give it a like. Um, and let me know what you guys think. I will try to add like some other codes towards the end of the video. And let me know which one looks best to you. And I might get it. So thank you. Bye. Thank you.